to get into the turtle is pretty hard. Um, right, we got this shell that we have to deal with. Luckily, they, the uh, supplier has already cut using a saw through the bone of the shell here and here. So I got two saw. Now I have to remove the plastron. And we see that the skin, this is reptile, right? So reptile skin is very tough. And I don't want to cut into the animal because I want to see what's inside of there. So if I use my scalpel and I cut along and see how my blade's going along with the plastron, that will damage the fewest internal organs and just get the tissues. Now, if it's real strong preserved, I can rinse it off. So the smell of the preservatives can really bother my eyes. I can rinse it off. If I rinse it off though, I'm now rinsing off the preserving power and depending how long I need this animal to, well, not rot, not really get moldy, uh, the less I wanna wash it off. So if I need it to last for a few months, don't wash it off. In my class, we're only gonna use this during reptiles. So we're gonna keep it until the lab practicum. So you can go ahead and rinse it off and that would be just fine. Now, if you're online, then we're not doing a lab practicum. You're just taking a quiz on it. And see how that starts to, see, with one hand, I start to pull it up and the other hand, I use my scalpel very attached to its shell does not want to let go. So that's bone that I'm pulling back. All right, so this is going to take me a minute or two, and I'm not going to put this all in the video. I'm going to do exactly what I'm doing here. I'm going to go all the way around, and then I'm going to remove the plastron, and I'll turn the camera back on.